Monday, March 10, 2014, this 10 year old male neutered cat came in because of the wound, the wound on the lower side of the cheek, below the eye. Now, this wound, we thought it was due to scratching because the ears, the ears are very dirty as well. You can see the ears is uh, full of black wax and this cat has never been groomed before the hair was matted now I tranquilized the cat and uh, opened up the teeth to check and you can see you can see that he has this button upper primola similar to the dog so, so as you can see the left side <coughs> The primola, which I will focus on, is abscessed and is similar to this in the dog. Now, in the dog, they have this condition called carnassial to abscess, and you can see the picture. There is almost similar. I see the other one, same same problem. You see, mala abscess from these two uh, illustration. Now you can see the same thing. Now I open the, the mouth again on the left side. That's not, no, no. That's not the same place. Now I open and show it, show that the cat has the same problem as this. You can see, uh, open exactly the same. And you can see that the tooth, the premolar tooth, we follow the same, same way. Uh. We follow the same way and you open up and you will see that the premolar tooth uh, has a abscess fistula we call it a fistula from the abscess with blood tinge discharge okay so now you can see that uh, this cat 10 year old cat has the same problem as the as the illustration now you can see that uh, there's an abscess here now you, you lift up here the premolar tooth has a fistula uh, coming out, so it looks like a facial wound due to stretching. But actually, this is a premolar abscess, and uh, as you can see, it's quite rare in cats. And uh, this is the first case, first case I've seen, because mostly cats don't have this problem. Now, we turn to the other side, we will see whether the other. The other side has the same problem or not. So now, now we just see the cheek first. The cheek is okay on this side. As you can see, there's no uh, there's no uh, wound under the eye as in the other side. Now we open up the we open up the 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 mouth and actually you can see you can see that the, the molar also is a periodontal disease stage 4 but there is no fistula no fistula going up to here as compared to the others now we turn over the other side as you can see the other side now the other side you can see that uh, the other side you can see below the eye below the eye you can see now, open up, open the mouth, you can see that this is the, this is the abscess molar, yeah. So after that I will give some gas and then I will uh, extract it out and then should solve the problem. So this is not the, the so this is not the, the wound on the face due to scratching, it's, the, it's called the mala abscess in the Persian cat and this is quite a rare thing because I have not never seen one so far <coughs> in my practice for over 30 years so but dogs dogs you can see is quite common and uh, you can see that even these uh, two drug companies they illustrate a dog but they don't illustrate the cats for mala abscess or carnassial 2 abscess I heard the mala abscess. So I'm recording this uh, rare finding in this cat. This 10 year old cat. It's a rare occurrence of mala abscess in a 
in a cat, but in the dog, there's nothing uncommon, especially older dogs. If you have done dentist, dental checkup every year or regularly, you will not have this problem. But uh, for the cat, the owner in Singapore seldom, seldom do open up the seldom do dental, dental cleaning. So this 10-year-old cat developed this mala abscess and uh, and uh, so I just documented it on the video to teach vet students to be uh, observant. Sometimes it's not what it looks like. It certainly looks like a facial wound due to ears, ear infected, infected ear scratching. As you can see, both ears are very black. Turn it out here, so the other ear is very uh, dirty there. Eh? Turn over and see. So, but the problem is not due to that. The problem, the complaint of this uh, left chin, turn over left chin abscess or left chin wound is actually a fistula, oronasal fistula or mala abscess in, open up again, in, open up again, in, in the premolar tooth, pull back a bit more. You can see that uh, the tooth is really rotten for this 10 year old cat. I'm trying to close up a bit. And the wound is here. This is the oral nasal, oral nasal fistula due to this uh, tooth. The cat has been a uh, quick ball. And uh, I will go and extract the tooth now. Mala abscess in the cat. Tarnasal tooth abscess in the dog as illustrated, which is much more common in dogs than in the cat. March 10, 2014, Topayo Vets, Singapore.